Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to download fonts and import them onto your Cricut Design Space. There are a couple different ways to do this, so I'm going to show you both. First, you can buy fonts off of Etsy and download them onto your computer. Once you buy your font, go to your purchases. From there, you should see your download files button and click that to go to the next page. In this instance, there are two types of fonts available to be downloaded the .ttf and the .otf. These are two different types of fonts used for different purposes. You can install both or just the one you need. Once you click download files, you'll see that there's a download button with a little cloud next to the font. Click that and then open up the file you just downloaded. Once you click the files you just downloaded, you'll see a button that says install font. Click that and your Mac system will show you that you have the font installed and ready to use. If your Cricut Design Space is already open, make sure you close out and restart it so that the system can process that you downloaded a new font. Insert a text box and click the drop down arrow to find the system fonts. Type in the name of the font, click on it, and now your text box should show the new font style. Now I'm going to show you how to download free fonts and use them for commercial use. It's important to make sure that the fonts you're using are royalty free and appropriate for commercial use so that you can use them to sell products. Once you download the font you want, you'll see that there's a zip file. From there, you click the zip file and a new folder should pop up. Similar to the Etsy fonts I purchased, I can see the download file available. Once you click on it, you can click install font and it should show up. Once again, make sure that your design space is restarted so that you can add the new font and follow the same steps of entering a text box, looking for the font, and your text will now display the new font that you just downloaded. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you like and subscribe to follow for more helpful small business tips. Bye-bye!